Kinetic energies also change co with coordinates. Find the kinetic energies for a 3D cylindrical coordinate system. Anyone remember how what, what a 3D cylindrical system looked like? And what did we have? R, Phi, Z. And how did we convert from X to that? In mathematical, we use theta instead of phi. So how did I define kinetic energy? T was defined as we have to differentiate it with respect to time. And we will have R that's varying and phi that's varying. So you can't really call one of them a constant. Oh boy. Oh boy, it's gonna be fun. How do we do this? Cosine is minus sign. I always forget which one. <laughs> Somebody confirm, I always forget. Yeah, yeah, that's it. That's it? And this one will be R dot. That one, I'm pretty sure I'm doing it right. Sine phi plus R cosine phi phi dot. Everybody understands where those dots are coming from, yes? Anybody confused? Anybody? No, good. Okay, so now I have to square them, right? Because I have to match them up with this guy. So this guy tells me I have to do x dot squared, which will be r dot squared cosine squared phi plus r squared sine squared phi phi dot squared minus two r dot cosine phi r sine phi phi dot. Yes? So all I did was use the equation a plus b squared equals a squared plus b squared plus 2ab. And if I have a minus sign here, I get a minus sign here. And then I will do a y dot squared, r dot squared sine squared phi plus r squared cosine squared phi, phi dot squared plus two r dot sine phi r cosine phi phi dot and z dot squared equal z dot squared, not gonna change. And now can I add all of them, all these equations? Anybody remember what cosine squared theta plus sine squared theta was? So do I get left with x dot squared plus y dot squared plus z dot squared equals r dot squared plus r squared phi dot squared. These two get canceled plus z dot squared because cosine squared phi plus sine squared phi equals one. And that means my T in cylindrical coordinates will be written as one half M R dot squared plus R squared phi dot squared plus Z dot squared. That's what we meant when we said find your T in the appropriate generalized coordinates. So like that. <laughs>